Welcome to Daniel Reviews. I'm Daniel Goodwin, and today we're not going to do a full review, but I am going to give you an update on the EchoFlow Smart Home Panel System you see behind me, and some new relays that EchoFlow shipped out to me to replace some faulty ones that I have. Let's dig into it. I mentioned in my previous video one of the problems I had with the Smart Home Panel was that a couple of the relays kept giving me trouble. They would uh, just randomly say that they weren't connected or had become unplugged when it, I hadn't touched anything or done anything to them. It was very annoying. I'd, I'd open up the panel and almost usually as soon as I opened the, the door on the panel, the, the air would clear and they'd say it's fine. I'd put the panel door back and any time later I would get an air again. So it was very problematic. Um, I contacted EchoFlow support, which they have a great support staff um, basically we we went back and forth and figured out if the problem is with the relays in this particular panel um, that the relay pins on on the old style relays were essentially not long enough and they're airing out so i want to show you just for comparison what they look like hopefully this will this will show all right so this is the new one here in my hand uh, a couple things i want you to focus on hopefully this will show um, let's just see if we can't zoom in a little bit and focus on this. There we go. Okay. Look at this, this pen right here. See how it is almost to the top, but not completely. And it's kind of the same on the other side. This one's all the way to the top, but not completely. All right. Now let's compare that to the old style. Let me hold them the same way. Um, this side looks exactly the same, right? But on this side, you can see the difference. See how much shorter this pen is? Hopefully you can see that. It's a little hard to pick up. But that one's a lot shorter. There we go. Maybe hold it like this. Like that. Yeah. Um, and you can see this one's a lot taller. So what's happening with these old style is it this third pen is just not long enough. And it, it trips the smart home panel into thinking it's unplugged. So this is the, the change that they had to make with the new relays. They're still getting them in. These are the 30 amp uh, relays. I'm waiting on some 20 amp ones still that are, are tripping on my cooktop. But I do think these new relays are going to fix the problem. And so I wanted to just do a quick video explaining what's going on. EchoFlow is standing by the product and they are shipping these out. Um, for people that are having problems with them. So if you're experiencing difficulties with yours, get in contact with EchoFlow support, tell them the behavior. Um, they can look up the serial number and confirm whether that's the issue. And if it is, they'll, they'll ship you out some, some replacement relays to get that taken care of. So 